Good afternoon, everyone. I just wanted to show you some very, very easy DIYs that I did with these little flat ornaments. Or oh, most of them are these flat ornaments. Um, you have seen these owls and these leaves in my um, what was it? My my fall decor video. And I just wanted to um, get something that I could use as bases um, to let them stand upright. And I got these uh, wood pieces in a big bag for a very low price. And I thought, wow, that's perfect. So I got this little owl. And this one I tried with two leaves. So you can have the owl in the foreground. Or in the background behind the leaves. Then I tried uh, with these little foxes. Same here, but the um, mushrooms are just painted on one side, which is a bit sad, but yeah. You should try to get them all less parallel, otherwise, it will look a bit weird. And um, here I have colored one of these leaves. So this is the um, color it came with and I simply used a colored gray, gray, crayon, no, a colored pencil, a red colored pencil to give this leaf a bit more color. Um, these are different bases, they were more expensive. These are, what is it, birch tree wood? I'm not sure. Um, so these two items are from my birthday haul from, um, late, did I upload it in, in, in late August? I think I did. Um, yeah, this is the mushroom with this, uh, missing piece, but it's fine. So I can, I can display it like this, because this, um, you can see it's almost smaller than my thumb. Um, thumbnail this little what is it squirrel <laughs> I have a lot of uh, more Christmassy like items I wish I would have set this little bunny like in a different angle maybe like this well now it's now it's like this so also these two items were from my birthday haul and they are pretty tiny um I think I think these both were thrifted last year. They were somewhere in a tea light holder. And I finally found a project for them. Oh kitty cat! <laughs> so these items are definitely from, also from my birthday haul. And I think this, this just works pretty fine. It's just really 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 easy things um a hanging ornament which i will no longer hang and a moose you can also hide the moose behind the tree that's the uh, tallest one that i got um i got a lot of new flat ornaments in in bags with a lot of them so this is also one of the the newest that i got it's it's so cute this little rocking horse Reindeer. Yeah, it's really pretty. <laughs> oh, kitty cat is curious. Just some trees. Tree with snowflake. Two trees with snowflake and this gives... So this is uh, the inside part of this tree. Uh, not exactly parallel, but... It gives a really nice, nice illusion here. Um, bit too far away from each other, but hey, don't break it. Also snowflake and tree. This works pretty well for winter. Same with this. Um, also more winter decor. These two, a different snowflake and tree. A moose and a small tree and also one of my hanging ornaments the snowman and a snowflake 
So these are the ones that I've made. And the nice thing is if you have a lot of the same ornaments like this, like I have here, and you have a lot of time on hand and you're searching for nice, oh, don't break it, <laughs> nice presents for other people, you can make uh, several of the same kind and have a really nice um, DIY gift. So the, these are definitely going to go into my display case and uh, they can finally stand up and will not fall. And these I will just put in the fall ones before fall ends. And yeah, we'll enjoy them. And I hope you enjoyed this and I hope I could give you a little inspiration of crafting. There's the kitty. He's just purring, laying, looking. So thank you guys so much for watching. And see you next video. Bye.